Thanks. Now, the aftermath of Helene in Western North Carolina leaving thousands with nothing. The Fox Cons, Anna Arinder, speaking to one family who says although they've lost so much, they are blessed to still have each other. Anna. Well, that's right, Justin. Tori, husband and wife, Daniel and Paulina, they live in Swannanoa in their home of 19 years with all of their belongings and memories now diminished to rubble. And this is video of what the property looks like now. Bits and pieces of tools, stuffed animals, their grandchildren's toys, muddy and tattered clothing. The couple rented out seven homes on this property, only two still standing. However, those are unlivable. They tell me that the morning of Helene, they weren't prepared, just packing a few bags and heading to a nearby hotel, coming back a few days later, finding nothing, losing their business along with their home. A lot of people lo lose family. I don't lose any of my family, but a lot of people lose wife, husband, son, nephews, brother. And I think that's bad. I can take back everything I have, but the people lose family. It's no matter how much money he can take it from ground from me, but he can take his family back. And that's no good. It's bad. Like if you, I lose one of my boys, and somebody in my house. <laughs> Or oh, somebody come here and give me uh, one million dollars, I can do anything, son. Take your money and give me money, son. Because his life is more important, my wife, my grandbabies. Eh? I'm thinking the money is good, but he can buy nothing if you lose somebody from your family. Absolutely heartbreaking speaking to this couple. Daniel says right now he's not sure what his family will do. They're trying to navigate through FEMA assistance. That's also a challenge because they're having to request a lot of the paperwork from the government and state agencies as many of their documents were also lost to the storm and it's what they need to get that FEMA assistance. For Fox Carolina, I'm Anna Arinder.